seven or eight rehearsals with the band before you went up? Yeah, at the most. At I the don't most. even think there was that many. And with the whole like, band. The whole band, too. Band too yeah. And you went out and practiced with them twice? Or twice. 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 Yeah. And in addition, I think it needs to be said, we, didn't, we started rehearsals exactly one month before the show opened. Mm -hmm. August 11th, we started rehearsals. September 11th, it opened. And the fact that we were able, granted it's only a two-person show, but the fact that it was able to be put together in that amount of time. Did you start working on your lines, by the way? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, I, yeah. And, and I, um, Jeanette was wonderful enough to break it down into what's called French scenes, mm -hmm. which every time a character enters or leaves, it's a new scene. And so it was pretty easy because Louise is in the sense of French scenes. So every time Louise came on stage and started to talk, I broke it down into those and I'd memorize it, go back and go through it again, go to the next one, go back and start at the beginning and see, make sure I had it all done. You know, the, the success of this show just isn't too pros, and I know that this is a uh, community theater, but I would consider your performances uh, absolutely as professional as professional can get. They could just, uh, to replace you, either of you, with any other so-called professional actress uh, in this great nation of ours, it would not have been a better show. Thank you. And I That's very nice of you. Yeah, but I think, you. I think the thing that really made this successful, it wasn't just that you were too polished, that you're too polished uh, performers, but I, you, you genu genuinely really like it. Oh, oh yeah! yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, and the freaky, the freaky thing is, the first night of rehearsals, we realized that we had sung together at a wedding about ten years, years ago. <laughs> and, and and so we had met and that was before. Fun. And I was in awe of her voice at that time, and I just started thinking, oh my gosh, she has the most incredible. She sings with such ease, and and um, mm -hmm. I, I don't even, I truly don't believe you realize how wonderful you are. Mm -hmm. I truly believe you. Don't believe well, I think the same thing about you. Ditto. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, uh, Jeanette, um, did this reach the uh, the expectations that you had at the very beginning? And beyond. And beyond. And it's, um, I think this is in my director's notes, but the show, the season was chosen later this year, and I had said no to the show the, initially. I to direct him? To directing the show because I have a little business I'm starting. My mother was not old, and and then Bonnie D called me and said, "I'll help you. Mm -hmm. You know, I'll, I'll do everything for you. All you have to do is direct." Ho ho ho. So the the difference between directing this show and other shows is a. I kept looking around, waiting for the cast to get here to start, <laughs> and they were here. <laughs> <laughs> and um, that I really became more integral in the marketing of the show and the, I painted that wonderful floor over there. You know what? <laughs> I was really impressed by that floor. <laughs> I was up in the mezzanine on the night that I came on opening night and that was the thing that I looked at. I always kind of scope over the set, see what the set's like and stuff. I like it more. <laughs> Thank you. Very nice. Well, we, we, we ran into some family issues. Two, a brother died, a brother was in hospice, which set our building time back, which set our painters back. So that's how I ended up. She was ways. down here doing, she was doing custom. She, she was in every um, aspect. Everything. Joni, what will you walk away from this show or drift away? from this show, <laughs> float away from this show, remembering the most? Oh, the people that I met, it's just Simmons start crying. I'm having the time of my life, it's just awesome. Sorry. No, that's all right, this is an emotional My <laughs> <laughs> artistic, emotional person. <laughs> Everybody's just well, it's that, it's that kind of heart that makes this show a success also. You bet. And How about you? How about you, Sam? I, I think that, well, a, apart from being able to create, I mean, Jeanette basically gave me license to be just a freak on stage. I mean, I am. I, I go, oh, I could try, I could try that. 
And now she's flirting with a man. She yeah. Can't <laughs> so you can't get her up on stage. It's not the same horse, isn't it? Well, oh, it's a different guy. Well, it's it's not, not, a different guy. Oh, right. yeah. Here's the great story that came out of this. This is just one of these little things that happen. I'm, I go down with the audience, and I ask this lovely man is smiling up at me, and I ask him to dance, and he gets up, and he says, he uses my name, not, not Luis. Sally, I, I had hip replacement surgery just a couple of weeks ago, so go easy on me. And oh, <laughs> brother, this is going to be fun. And then he, I just danced with him for a couple of minutes and asked the guy behind him. I, I had a, I'm an interior designer, and a couple of days later I had an appointment here in Traverse City. And I pull into people's driveway, and the man comes walking down the, the driveway towards me. It's the guy that I asked to dance. They had a hip replacement surgery. And he said, well, how are you? <laughs> So it, it's a very small world, but the the every night is a different guy out in the out in the audience, and that's kind of a fun. And sometimes thing. I spot him for her. I like yes. I spotted Grant Parsons for her. For, for me and um, who? Oh, but one night they they it tried to find someone who would dance with me, but he said no. And then I, as I'm going up the aisle, I, I see someone who was a, a vet who I've seen on stage before. I've never really met him before. Phil. Um, Hell yeah. And, and asked him to dance, and he was kind enough to get up and dance with me, too. So people have been really great about it. They've been, they've been wonderful. But one thing I wanted to mention that we haven't talked about is this wonderful band behind us. And he just walked, and he just walked well, in. Well, there he is. <laughs> and, and, I, and, and I never said this to Don, but when you're talking about a professional band that's up here, I, my, I, I expected them to be wonderful. I had no idea they were going to be as fabulous as they are. I also expected attitude. <laughs> you know, I, I thought, we're just these kind of communicative people, and these guys are professionals, and they play all over the country, not right. just in, in, right. around here. And I expected a lot more attitude from them. And they're, every one of them are so much fun and such a good time to be around and are very supportive of us. Oh, yeah. Good. Yeah, they're always asking us after each show, what can we do different? What do we need to change? Well, the three of you are. The three of you, because the, the director's eyes up in the audience, so he's involved. Oh, she never comes in. Anyway, you're going to be going up today in what? Uh, in about an hour, right? So I'm going to let I'm going to uh, go ahead and wrap this up. Thank you so much, Sally. Yeah, nice to see you. Joni, best to you. Thank you. And, uh, Thanks, Wayne. Jeanette, thank you very much, and uh, both of you keep on performing. You know, I mean, 30 years, and this is your first time after 30 years? What's the matter with you? I don't know. <laughs> I was sleeping for 30 years. <laughs> crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Are you crazy? <laughs> yes, that's, a num am. that's a number in this show, right? <laughs> right? Anyway, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. you bet. Okay. Mm -hmm. Great. Thank you. Right. That's it. You take care. Thank you. Thank you.